All right, we just fucking picked up our 75 cent wings from Harbell Sports Car. Sports Car? Sports Bar and Grill. All right, I'm super stoked to eat these. I'm about to eat them in five seconds, and I'm going to give you the official review, so Thank hold tight. Holding tight. As always, I'm super stoked to eat these, uh, mostly because I'm fucking starving. Uh, just got off work. Didn't really have time to get that drunk, but that's cool because it uh, doesn't mean I can't crack a beer and get a little bit baked before I eat these wings. So let me jump right in real quick. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right. So like you probably saw, got these from the local bar and grills. Harbell's one of my favorite little joints. And it is Wednesday, which means they have 75 cent wings, so you know I had to grab a couple today. So today, I'm fucking trying two different flavors, not buffalo. They have two different kinds of buffalo on the menu, but I didn't get either one of those. So today, I got the, um, these are weird flavors. One of them is Boneyard. That's going to be this more yellow one. It's more of like a mustardy thing. The description of it was like a paragraph and a half long. Didn't really read all of it. The other one is called Sriracha Yaki. So that is a mixture of teriyaki and sriracha sauce. And I've never had either one of these, so I'm super stoked. So, as always, two wings, two drums, and let's just fucking jump in, because these are hot, hot right now. All right, so I'm going to start off with the uh, the Boneyard right here. All right, so right off the bat, not super huge, but they never really have been, but they're always really good, so let's fucking try it. Okay. Uh-huh. I like it. I think. It's not great, but I like it. Definitely a mustard taste. A little bit spicier mustard, so I get down with that. Definitely fuck with that. Mm. I don't know if it's really that good, or if it's just fucking hitting the spot right now because I'm so hungry. Either way. Shit. Okay, yeah, that's good. Would I order it again? Probably not, but only because there's like four other flavors that I really, really like. And this one is okay. Um, first impression 79 out of 100, maybe 78. It's decent. Finish her off. All right. Okay. That's just the wing. That's just, or the excuse me. That's just the drum, though. So, before we move on, no reason we can't get a little buzz on. I found one shooter in my freezer, so you know I can't not drink it right now. <clears throat> Ugh, it's gonna be really gross with this mustard taste in my mouth. I was right. Thanks, Jim Beam. Shout out, Jim Beam. Okay. Let's do one of these, too. This place I'm a little biased on, too, because it's also the best place in Springfield where you can get a good pitcher to drink for a really low price and cop some 75 cent wings and just leave there super satisfied and spend like $10. So get drunk and get lots of food for the low. So this next one, the um, Sriracha Yaki, this is what I really came for. This is what I'm really trying to do. So let's jump in. I'm gonna try this wing. Again, not super big, not, I mean, can't tell. It's not, it's not anything special, but let's try it out. It's 75 cents, so fuck it. Whoa. Yeah, okay. Definitely getting both flavors for sure. Like immediately, I just tasted it and I was like, that's just fucking teriyaki. Two seconds later, spice, definitely getting that sriracha. Still feeling the sriracha. 
I'm liking it. I'm liking this so far. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah, I would definitely get this one again. Probably will. I go here like every Wednesday, so probably try it again. A little fun fact about this place. Um, there's actually another place in Springfield that got number one. They were voted number one best wings in Springfield. And uh, this place didn't get voted number one, but they actually get their wing from the exact same place, like the physical wing itself. But place number one usually fries them. This place usually smokes them, which is like their, their signature thing. But fuck it, I just got fried wings because that's how I like to roll. So anyway. Yeah. So the wing, yeah, the wing itself, just the chicken, nothing special. Um, I would give it like a 70 out of 100. It's just a regular ass wing. That's fine. That's what everyone has. But the sauce itself, super heat. I'm going to give that sauce a 86. I like it. I would get that again for sure. So with that being said, those are just the first ones. I mean, first one was a drum. That was a wing. So now I got to do the opposite of both. But first, first, I have to take 20 minutes and do that. <coughs> All right, moving on. Back to the Boneyard, which is a cool name. <coughs> I think I read in that big ass description, <coughs> God damn it, <coughs> that they get this name because like you eat it and then like the only thing left are bones. It's pretty rad. It's like a boneyard. Alright, so <coughs> don't want to waste any of this guy. I'm not really a big mustard fan per se, like especially like the spicy mustard. <coughs> but like I said, like it's hitting the spot right now. I could just be fucking starving, but either way, I could eat like 25 of these. Either flavor. That's how you do that. You gotta do the crack and split sometimes. It's the best way to get all of it. I know everyone's got their technique, but yeah, the fucking crack and split, it's OG. After that nine hour work day, that, that, and this, it's really all I want right now. This is hitting the spot so well. I'm gonna be kind of baked whenever I go get groceries in 10 minutes anyway, so stoked on that too. All right, sorry. Back to the Sriracha Yaki, which whenever I ordered this on the phone, the lady didn't know what the fuck I was talking about. I was like, it's one of your flavors, right? She was like, I don't know what that is. And I was like, it's on the menu, I swear. But nonetheless, I got it. Mm -hmm. This particular wing, I'm not saying anything about the place itself. This particular wing, a little bit crunchier. It's got like those hard parts on the outside that a lot of wings have, but it's like 30% of the wing itself. So I'm not super thrilled about that. That kind of just makes it me think that it's just like fried stuff and not really chicken. But it's okay. I just, you know, 
Like I said, it's fucking doing the job right now. I'm fucking starving, so. The sauce is obviously just the same, so fucking 96 on that. The wing getting like a 68 on this one. Maybe a 69, because that's cooler. Probably a 68, though. Alright. I feel good about that. I got 10 of them for like 8 bucks. Can't fucking go wrong with that. If you go to Hooters, it's like six for nine sometimes, so they can eat five dicks. So I feel good about this. Not Definitely not the best wings in town, like some people think they are, but Harbell is always a good place to go. Like I said, you really go there for the atmosphere. Eating it in your fucking room, not the same as being there. It's like 40 TVs in there. All of them have Blues games on and shit. And fucking, yeah, good wings, cheap wings, cheap beer. Definitely can't go wrong, so hold that thought and I'll give you my official review in this one. They hooked it up with the napkins. <coughs> Clutch. Alright. Now that I've had time to think about it. Overall. <coughs> when you're just. <coughs> this video. <coughs> fucked. This whole thing. Fucked. <coughs> when you're just eating the food. It's not great. <coughs> God damn <coughs> <coughs> Rewind. <coughs> Getting over bronchitis. Okay. When you're just eating the food, it's okay. Like, definitely these wings. Cheap, pretty good. Overall. <coughs> 82. 82 out of 100. Nothing's <coughs> nothing special. But, nonetheless, Harbell's shout out. You know I love you. I'll be again. I'll be back in <coughs> seven days. We'll be drinking again soon. I'll be there. Hopefully I won't be coughing this much next time. <coughs> anyway, thanks, Harbells. I'm super stoked on this, and I'll see you next time. <coughs> ah, I don't know.